it's Lisa here and welcome back to my channel. Today we have a new Friday things. We have quite a few items to get through here today. So we are just going to go ahead and jump into this sticker haul, accessory haul, <laughs> and subscription box haul. <laughs> so yeah guys, let's go ahead and get started. All right, y'all. The first items I have here are two bookmarks. These bookmarks are from a shop called Lila Lou. Uh, the shop owner's name is Amelia, and she is from the Philippines. Now, I first saw these on Instagram, of course. I saw them on, I think there is a new uh, planner, Instagrammer named Jessica Plans. There are so many Jessicas out there, y'all, but her name is Jessica Plans. And I think I saw these on her channel first, if I'm not mistaken. But anyhow, I just thought these were so cute and I wanted to pick up a couple. So this first one here is a little uh, dog paw. And I picked this up in the silver. And I picked this up because we used to have a little Shih Tzu, y'all, but we no longer have her. And this little paw print just reminded me of her. But I love these little bookmarks, guys. These are so cute. And I think when you have things like this, they just add a little extra if you, uh, extra like me <laughs> when you are taking your Instagram photos and you want to add something cute to the pictures and stuff. So here is the silver one. And then of course, this gold one here is a rose. Let me open it up for you guys. Okay, here it is. This is a rose and of course I had to pick this one up. Uh, I have mentioned on this channel before that I had a little sister and her name was Rose. She died when she was three years old. And whenever I see anything that reminds me of her or, uh, you know, just roses in general, I try to pick it up if I can. And of course I had to get this one. So this is in rose, I mean, uh, this is a rose, like I said, and it is in gold. And I just got, uh, Lisa Lynette inscribed as my name. So yeah, you guys can uh, check her out if you're interested, but you can get anything um, in your name, your planner channel, whatever you like. She does these things by hand and they are amazing. She also does little paper clips and things like that as well. And that is what I picked up from Lee La Lu. All right, y'all. Next, I have my very first subscription box by Simply Gilded. I'm sure you guys have seen this all over Instagram and YouTube already. But, of course, I wanted to get on here and show you guys as well. Uh, now, guys, I already have a peach washi, as you know, <laughs> if you have watched any of my videos this past May. I think I used it in every spread, maybe except one. So when I saw that we were getting peach, I was like, oh man, I already have peach. But I wanted to go ahead and get this box anyhow because there are extras in here. And let's just go ahead and jump into this box, y'all. <laughs> All right, guys. The first thing you have when you get the box opened is your little card telling you what everything is. Now, the first thing we have here is this cute little pin. This is a uh, diamond top pin. I think they call them gem top pins, but I'll just call it a diamond top because it's shaped like a diamond. <laughs> but these are cute pins. I love adding these in my spreads for pictures as well. And then we have a little notebook here. This is a pocket size notebook and I have no idea what I am going to do with this little notebook at the moment. I have had one of these before and what I did with it was I would write down uh, what I would do during the day 
and then I would uh, go ahead and then uh, use that as my pre-planning notes for my Erin Condren. So yeah, I might end up keeping this or I might, I don't know, I haven't decided yet. But anyway, I have been seeing people take these little notebooks and putting uh, their swatches of washi in the notebook. But I'm like, I don't understand why people are swatching the washi. I just don't get it. I don't understand it. I don't need to see swatches of my washi when I'm looking at it in my little box and stuff. I don't know. I don't know why people are doing it. They just want to keep records of it, the names and all that stuff. And I'm like, I, I don't need all that. You know, it's not necessary for me. <laughs> and then, guys, we have these little clips right here, which I do love. Uh, like I said, when it comes to photographing my pictures for Instagram, I'm extra. And, you know, when you get these little clips here, you can just add these little clips into your photos. And they just add a little something to the, the photos. Well, we can't get that off right now. But, yeah, you have this little bowl one. You have one that says relax. And then you have the peach, which I think is really, really cute. And then, guys, we have this little pink and white plaid bow. Now, I am not a fan of big bows hanging off my planners like this. So, um, I am probably going to do a giveaway. I want to do a giveaway when I reach 100 subscribers. So, <clears throat> this may be in the giveaway. We shall see. Maybe the notebook as well. I'm not really sure. And then, guys, we have the journaling card. Now, I do keep my journaling cards. I keep them in a little drawer at my desk because you never know when you're going to need a cute journaling card for a setup in your TN notebook. So, I always keep the journaling cards. If I get two of them, I normally throw them away if I get duplicates, but... I always try to keep one. And then, guys, we have these stickers right here. And you have three kind of like full box stickers. And then you have flags. And then you have today important headers and things like that. And then you have um, decor stickers. And they're just in the shapes of peaches. Now, I did not know what I was going to do with this. And then I saw Holly from Holly Plans posted a picture on Instagram and she used it in her TN spread. And I was like, yeah, I guess I could do something like that. I was really inspired by her, by that uh, post she did. So I think I might do that in my B6 spread this week because I didn't have a, a kit planned for this week. And uh, some of my summer kits that I want to use for those a B6 spreads I got from um, the Planner Collective sale a couple of weeks ago. So they are not here yet. So I think I'm going to do that in my spread this week. And then, guys, we have the washi tapes right here. Uh, this card right here was in the back of this card. So I thought I would just turn it over and use it so that we could see the washi and guys i am so sorry about these shadows in my video today i do not know what is going on i tried to film in natural light in my living room but i wouldn't have been able to see the viewfinder in the phone so i have this leaned over so i can kind of see what i'm doing but i am so sorry about the shadows i'm after we, after I do this part right here, I'm going to see if I can kind of fix it for you guys. But I do apologize for that. But anyhow, let's go into the washi tapes. This one right here is a really cute plaid. And this is so cute, guys. You guys know I do weekend washi banners. And that was the reason why I just decided to go ahead and keep this. Because right here, this whole thing right here, guys, is a weekend banner. So, I was like, yes, I love it. But I have done all of my spreads for May in peach. So, <laughs> I don't have any peach spreads for this month. But I, like I said, I'm going to try to use some of this in my B6 spread and see how it's going to turn out. Because I am going to be making some uh, 
washi boxes. But this one right here is a script. It says Peach, Peachy Dreams. And it's just floral and script. Here it is, swatched. And then guys, I think this one right here is my favorite out of the whole box because I just love this teal and gold and peach. And I think you will be able to mix this in different uh, weekend banners. So I love this one. I'm trying to make this all neat for you guys. <laughs> I'll bring you in a little bit closer here. Let me get all the washi rolled out. And then, of course, we have the peach and gold bowls. Like I said, I already have, and I have been using it all month long. So, yeah, this is the new one, guys. And I'm going to roll out my old one just to show you all. Uh-oh, let's fix that. <laughs> All right, guys, and then we have this skinny one right here. This is the 10 millimeter peach. Now, this is the first time she's had the 10 millimeter in the peach. Because like I said, when I got my peach, there was no 10 millimeters. So that's that. And then, guys, here is the old one um, that I have. And let's put it next to the new one to see if there is any difference. I don't think there's going to be, but... To me, it looks the same, guys, so, but yeah. I know that there were a lot of people wanting her to bring peach or they want some kind of an orange color, so yeah, there we go. Let me bring you guys in a little bit closer. So yeah, guys, that is the washi that we got in this month's subscription box. Like I said, this is my very first subscription box, and... I love it so far, and I am happy that I was able to subscribe. All right, y'all. The next thing I have here is my very last planner press dash box. Uh, Savannah, I think that is her name, decided that she is not going to be doing the da uh, dash boxes anymore. She is just going to be doing the digital dash boxes. So you guys know I am not all about that digital life. <laughs> I don't even know how to print that stuff out, let alone cut it and all that stuff. And I don't even like printing out inserts. That is why come I went to this so much crafting inserts because I don't like cutting them out. I don't like trying to get them together or none of that stuff. I like my paper to be stapled. I like my paper to be even. I like it to be all nice and neat. So, no digital stuff for me, y'all. Anyhow, this is the last box. So, let's go ahead and see what we have in here, guys. All right, guys, the first thing we have here is our thank you card, of course, giving us all of the information we would need to contact Savannah and telling us to enjoy the box and everything like that. And then, guys, we can go ahead and slide this out and see what we have. Okay, guys, the first thing we have here are stickers. Uh, you can use this in a B6 spread or however you like. And I think I might give this a go this time. I think I might try to use this in my TN spread. And then, guys, let me go ahead and take these things out of the package. I should have already done that. So let me do that real quick. Okay, guys, the, the next thing we have here is this little bow that you can hook on to your TN. You can either hook it on to the front or you can hook it on to the back. And like I said, I am not a fan of these big bows hanging on the outside of my TN. So I don't know what I am going to do with these bows. I was thinking that I could take this little uh, claw out of here. And I don't know if you guys have seen those long paper clips. I could hot glue one of those big, long, gold paper clips 
onto the back of this and make a little um, paper clip bow, but I'm not really sure. I don't know. I don't really like those. I just don't like big bows. <laughs> I don't know. <laughs> Call me a weirdo, but I just don't like them. I'm, I'm sorry. <laughs> And then, guys, we have our cards that we get in the box every month. This first one here says, Aloha. This one says, Life is better in a bikini. And then you have Summer Vibes. And Offline is the new luxury. I think these are so cute. Did I give you guys a close-up view of these? And this one that says... Aloha. Then you just get a sticky notepad. There was also some washi in this box as well. It has the pattern of the palm trees and some shades on the uh, palm trees here. And then guys, we will go ahead and go through the acetates and vellums. Let me get a piece of paper real quick. All right, y'all, we'll just go ahead and go through the uh, acetates real quick. And this first one here says, let's go vacation. And it has a black stripe on it along with a palm trees. You have your little hat in your bag. So this kit I'm thinking is uh, vacation themed or, you know, palm trees and all that good stuff. Then we have this next one that says, don't worry, be happy. And it has the same shades and palm trees as the um, washi tapes, which this is so cute, y'all. I like the theme of this uh, box this month. And then we have this next one, which is pink flamingos and the little uh, flamingo has little uh, black feathers on it, which I like that. She added a little, a little color in there with the black and green and white. And then this last one here are palm tree, trees leaves. And they are all green on a clear uh, acetate. Now we can go ahead and go through the vellums. And this first one here is pink with black leaves in it, in there. Then you have this next one that says salty but sweet. <laughs> it's a hashtag and it has a little sundress with bracelets and your sandals. This next one is striped black and white, and it has the straw hat along with your bathing suit. And the last one, guys, has the palm trees, and it is black and white. It looks like almost like a zebra print, but it matches the kit, so it's, it's all, you know, palm trees themed and all that good stuff. But yeah, guys, that is my last box from Planner Press. I was a little bit disappointed when uh, she said she wasn't going to do this box anymore. But I was like, oh, well, <laughs> you just have to find something new or, you know, there are plenty of other subscription boxes for uh, TN setups and all that good stuff. But I don't think I'm going to sign up for anything else. Uh We'll just play it by ear when it comes to these setups and things like that. Just, you know, see what happens. All right, guys, that is it for this Planner Press Dash Box. All right, y'all, we're going to go ahead and jump into the stickers now. This first purchase is from Arctic Paper Studio. She was having a 30% off this day. Usually when she have a new release, she will offer a 30% off coupon. And so I decided to go ahead and take her up on her offer. So let's go ahead and open this up. All 
right guys your order comes in this cute little doily right here this is so cute and i think this will work really well with that um planner press dash box right <laughs> And then, guys, we have a couple of little freebies here. We have this little house-shaped die cut right here. Then we have this little, um, I think this is a flower, but this is a die cut as well. Then we have another little freebie. It has stickers on here. You have some flags. You have a today. You have two circled icons along with a quarter box and a little full box right there. Is that a full box or? Well, it's a box and it looks like it's ha it has washi and then it has some decorations in it. But anyway, it's cute. It is on matte paper. It's a premium matte paper. Then she has a little thank you card in here just thanking you for placing your order now the first thing i have here guys is this little uh trash day sticker these are in the silver foils if you didn't know arctic paper is a foiled shop so uh i think i paid like a dollar and 30 cent for these stickers so anytime i can get a good deal on some foil I'm gonna go for it <laughs> then we have this pink right here I think it's a hot pink uh, foil it says trash day then I picked up these planning stickers right here guys these are supposed to be in gold now they look rose gold but I'm pretty sure I ordered gold but anyhow, it's spoiled and I love them. <laughs> I picked up two of those. Yeah, this is rose gold. I thought I had picked up gold, but I'll use those all the same. Then I picked up these fill up stickers right here. Fill up fuel when I'm getting gas and these are gold then I picked those up in silver as well then I picked up the gold trash day and they are in rose gold as well then we have a wash the car in gold then we have rose gold and we have the silver. Then we have our more gas stickers in rose gold. And that is what I picked up from Arctic Paper Studio, guys. Like I said, she, she was having 30% off and I think I paid like $1.63 or something like that for each one of these stickers. So to me, that was a good deal. All right, y'all, this next purchase is from Oh Hello Michelle. And here is the little cute card that the purchase came in. And guys, this is a small purchase. And I'll tell you the reason why here in a minute. But this is what the card says on the inside. Thank you so much for your purchase. You're the bee's knees, the bomb.com, you're amazeballs. I can't say thank you enough, XO Michelle. <laughs> I wanted to read that because I think that is just the cutest thing, thebomb.com. <laughs> but anyhow, guys, here is the sampler that came in here, or the freebie, as some might say. And I think this is so cute. Look at that little television and the Bebo kissing her little TN. Is this a Bebo or a Bidu? I think it's a Bidu. <laughs> Anyhow, guys, I picked up these car wash stickers because I needed some more of these. And I thought they were adorable. 
And I picked up these Happy Mail stickers because I think this is so cute. And I am pretty sure the postman or postmen or women out there, when we get these Etsy packages in the mail all the time, they are pretty much saying this. <laughs> hey, lady, your mail is here. So, so I thought these were so cute. And I am pretty sure those... Uh, male men and women are often wondering what are what is in those packages y'all and then the reason why i placed this order for from oh hello michelle is because i wanted these stickers right here they say case of the mondays and i saw one of my uh youtube friends here um uh, Excuse me, y'all. I am trying to swallow <laughs> Roxy from Roxy Plans. She had one of these stickers in her planner, and I just fell in love because you guys know I love to mark my Mondays in some kind of way, and this right here is perfect for me. <laughs> Anytime I see some kind of Monday sticker, I'm always going to pick it up. So, yeah, that is my order from Oh Hello Michelle. I love these little bee doos or bee bows or <laughs> characters. I just think they are adorable. But yeah, guys, that is my order. All right, y'all. This next shop is a new to me shop as well. This shop was participating in the PBC sale, and this is my first order from the PBC sale, actually. I only think I, I purchased from four shops during the PBC sale. But yeah, this is the first uh, order to come in. It is from Cricut Paper Co. And here is the freebie, guys. Disneyland stickers. And I didn't pick up much from her, but I did want to try her shop out. She had some gold for things on sale. And I think she was having... 40% off or 60% off or something like that. But I picked up these laundry stickers in gold. And then we have silver. And we have rose gold, y'all. These stickers are all on a clear uh, background. So you can pretty much put them on anything. They have it that clear vinyl like background there then i picked up some work stickers i needed some more gold work stickers i'm getting low on those and then i picked up some of these large date dots i wanted to try some larger ones to see how they would work out so these are pretty big compared to the rose color days <laughs> stickers but like i said I like them because they are on this clear backing and uh, sometimes when the stickers have that white background you know they don't work on everything so I like the clear backing and I picked those up in silver and rose gold as well but yeah guys that was my small purchase from a Cricut Paper Co okay guys this next purchase is from tasseled planner this was actually two separate purchases this was part of her two dollar tuesday and then this was a purchase that i made uh i think maybe a day or two before the two dollar tuesday if i had known she was going to have a two dollar tuesday i would have just waited or if i had known that i was going to purchase something on her two dollar tuesday i would have just waited and purchase everything at the same time but anyhow guys <laughs> I got two samplers the uh, this is the freebie here they are quarter boxes in a pastel shade so we got two of those and I put in notes to seller I think uh, what is her name um, Amy from Two Little Bow Babies. I loved her freebie and I put her name in the notes to seller, like I said, and I got this 
exclusive sampler here. And I just loved her sampler because it's full of things that I would use. You know, you have your Hello Monday, you have bows. Now, the only thing I probably wouldn't use right here is the no school because I don't have kids in school and I'm not in school. But everything else on this sampler, I, I will use definitely. And then guys, I wanted to try some of her bows. You guys know I am on the hunt for some floral bows since Rose, not Rose Color Days, uh, Clever Girl Crafts, uh-oh, this is upside down, I'm sorry. Clever Girl Crafts is not selling her foil uh, bows anymore. Well, not now, I don't know if she's gonna con sell them again, but she does have her bows in her shop. They are just not foiled. So, I'm on the hunt for some good foil bows now, y'all. But these are really cute. These are like bow tie bows and I like these. I just decided to try these out. So I just picked up the pink sheet because I know I use a lot of pink. And I also picked up these little bowls right here to see how they would work. These are little kiss cut bowls and they are tiny y'all. They are so cute. They are so tiny. See these might work in uh in for those uh, clever girl crafts bows but yeah picked up some of these and then i picked up these little laundry baskets y'all because i thought they were adorable she has really cute little foiled icon stickers that you can use instead of the little round circle icon ones i'm kind of like getting over those because when I buy those sheets, you know, every time I get ready to look for something, it's never on there, something that I need, or it's just like, I'm like, oh, I don't know if these, I'm getting any use out of these or not. But anyway, I love these right here. They just have a little foil on the corner, and then they have all the different little colors. These are in gold. And then I picked them up in rose gold. I don't know where the silver, did I forget silver, y'all? Oh, my goodness. I have to go back and get some silver ones but these are in rose golds then i picked up some grocery baskets because i i just love these i think they are so cute and that they just not like one fire color like gold or you know you still get to add a, in a little color along with your foiling so yeah these are in gold oh and i think what i did was i I think I just picked up golds because I knew I was going to be doing summer spreads and I wasn't going to be doing too much silver. So I think that's why I picked these up in gold and rose gold. And that's why I don't have silver. But I am going to go back and pick up some more things from her because I love her little stickers. Then I picked up these quarter boxes, y'all. And these are in um, uh, her colorful palette and i think i picked these up as well because i knew i was going to be doing a lot of summer spreads and i knew they were going to have these colors in them but these are so cute i love them love them love them and then guys she was having a two dollar tuesday where she had these headers and she had something else and you could pick these headers up in different colors she had about four different colors, but I only picked up the ones that I thought I was going to need because these have little gold stars in them. I don't know if you guys can see that. So they were pretty much made for like a 4th of July spread or something like that. And I knew that I had um, a spread that I wanted to use in these colors right here. So I just picked up these ones in gold. And then I picked up the blue ones here, and they are in a silver. But yeah, guys, that is my purchase from Tassels Planners. And I love all of my little foil things that I have here. I think they are so cute. But you guys should check her shop out if you haven't already. All right, y'all, this next shop is a new to me shop as well. It is called Color Pop Paper, and I saw Kiara from Paper Princess Plans 
uh, I saw this shop in one of her hauls and I wanted to give it a try. So here is the freebie that came with my purchase. And y'all, the reason why I wanted to try this shop out is because I wanted to try out these glitter headers. Y'all, these are real glitter headers. They are so cute, I love them. And guys, I have already placed another order from for some more of these headers because I love them. They are real glitter, guys. You guys should feel these. I mean, it's real glitter and it's not coming off of the paper. <laughs> so I picked up this blue color right here. And there are quite a few of them, guys. You can just peel them off. You can see it, it's on a clear paper in the background and you can see that from here. Let me see if I can find some kind of way to show you guys. But that's the split right there. And y'all know I'm, I'm bad with taking stuff off and all that stuff, my fingernails. and <sighs> I can't peel them off right now, guys, but they are glitter headers. And like I said, they are so cute. I love them. But that's a blue shade. I picked up a gold shade, guys. I picked up a hot pink shade. One is a hot pink shade, and one is supposed to be a just a regular pink shade. But I'm going to be honest with you, this one right here looks more purple, more magenta. And I don't know if this is necessarily a hot pink, but it could be hot pink. But anyway, these are two different pink shades. Oh, here's a little thank you card, guys. I didn't see that in there. <laughs> says hi lisa thank you so much for your order hope you love the new glitter and foil lindsay which i do i just absolutely love these headers guys and then i picked up these foiled weekend banners guys her foil is a little different than everybody else's it's supposed to be like a pressed foil and the only way i can explain this to you guys is when you get a wedding invitation or you get a graduation invitation, how they have the foil on top of the invitation. That is what this foil, foiling is like. And it is just absolutely beautiful. I picked these up in a gold. And then I picked up some date covers, guys, because I wanted to, like I said, I wanted to give them a try. And like I said, these are so cute and I chose this colorway right here it's called poolside because I thought that it would match some of the summer spreads that I have coming and am going to be using for the summer but yeah guys it does come with these little date dots as well but yeah that is my order from Colourpop paper and guys when I purchase these right here i purchased these on a friday and y'all she shipped them about two hours later so it was super fast i got these super quick and yeah that is my order from ColourPop paper all right guys this next order is from a shop called plush paperies and yes it is new to me <laughs> as well and what i picked up from her was a kit but this is the little card that came with it on the other side you get a little rewards uh section for a 20 dollar credit if you collect 10 of her little stickers and let's see here is the freebie or a freebie and it's really cute and then you have this freebie right here it says Brittany I don't know if I use Brittany's code or not I'm not really sure but I'm always looking for codes when I uh, purchase anything from any shop I immediately go to Instagram and look for a code <laughs> but yeah that's a Brittany freebie and here is the kit that I purchased guys it is it doesn't have a name on it, but I've been seeing this kit 
around on Instagram and Etsy. And I think a lot of people are calling it like a blogger style kit a, or a blog kit. But here are the four boxes, guys. This is so cute. I love the pinks and the peaches in here. But it says hello in this box right here. Then you have the girl typing here. But this is so cute. This is on a matte paper, y'all. And it is a very soft matte paper. Now, I'm not going to say it's a premium matte paper. But it's not a really, really hard matte paper. But it's a nice matte paper. So, yeah. This is a mini kit, I believe. So here are the uh, half boxes. You have two uh, Monday through Sunday trackers here. You have bill dues, and then you have your regular habit trackers along with some scallops, quarter boxes. You have a few flags over here. Then we have your weekend banner. You have some scallop checklists here along with some functional items and some icons here and this last page right here guys is your washi page along with your uh, date covers and then you have some washi strips now guys I had intentionally purchased this to go into my traveler's notebook but I don't know I might save this and use this next year sometime because it is peach and pink and I can use this next year in May. So we shall see. But that is my purchase from Plush Papery. All right, y'all. This last purchase is from Katie Elizabeth Plans. Here is the freebie. Now, I found this shop by just shopping around on Etsy and I wanted to give her shop a try. This first kit right here is a mini kit and it is called, uh, let's see what this kit is called. It's another blogger kit, y'all. It says blogger social. So I'm just going to call it the social blogger kit. <laughs> and I just thought this was so cute. I know that this kit has been around. I think I've seen it. So I think it's a old kit, but I just loved it and I wanted to go ahead and pick it up. Here are the full boxes. And I think what drew me to this kit was the camera because you guys know I love cameras and anytime I see anything with a camera in it, I'm either drawn to it or I want to get it. So yeah, that's why I picked this kit up, I think. <laughs> But here are your half boxes and you have headers on this page. Then you have your washi strips here. You, uh, not washi strips. Well, you do have washi strips. <laughs> and you have bottom washi. You have a three heart checklist here along with your habit trackers. And you have a little label right here. And then this last sheet, you have your weekend banner. You have some checklists here. You have flags and you have labels and quarter boxes. You have two bill dues here. You have your kiss cut icons here and you have your circular icons here. And she does provide a couple of uh, script items for you as well. Now this right here is a full kit and the name of this kit is called Stay in Bed if I'm not mistaken. Yeah, it's called Stay in Bed. Now I have had this kit right here before I purchased it earlier this year, but I sent it to my sister and so I loved it so much I wanted to repurchase it and I thought I would give her shop a try since I had purchased this from somebody else the last time because I love the blues and the mauve colors here, the pinks. So I was like, I want to pick that kit up again. So I did. But those are the full boxes. And then here we have the half boxes, guys, along with our uh, header page. And look at this bottom washi, guys. It is so pretty with the roses in it. 
And the color payoff on here, guys, it is so saturated. I love it. And this right here is a premium matte uh, paper. So it is really soft and smooth. And guys, this page is uh, exactly like the same, the last page that was in the mini kit. And then we have our checklist and our uh, boxes as well with all our functional items as well. Now, I thought this was a full kit, but maybe it's a mini kit. Maybe I picked up two mini kits. I thought I had did something different here, but no, I think it's two mini kits. But yeah, guys, that is what I purchased from Katie Elizabeth Plans. These are really cute kits and I love them. Oh, I think that's what I did. I picked up two different matte papers. That's what it was. So this right here is a premium matte and this right here is a regular matte. I wanted to see what the difference was in the matte paper. And to be honest with you, they both feel like really nice matte papers. But I noticed on this paper right here, the color payoff is a little bit better than the color payoff on this paper. So yeah, that is it guys. That is gonna be all for this haul. Let's gather up our things for our picture. All right, y'all, that is going to be it for this week's Friday Things. I hope you guys enjoy this video, and I hope you guys found something here that you might want to go out and pick up if you have not picked up anything or any of these things already. Let me know in the comments down below if you have, and I appreciate you guys so much for watching the video and as always guys i hope you are having a great weekend or a great day whenever you are viewing this video right here and i will talk to you guys in the next one bye y'all